we're comfortable with Brandon being the starter. We think he's going to get in there and uh, do a great job. Um, did Coach Miles tell y'all as a group, uh, or uh, did he? Yeah, yeah, you expect yeah. him to talk about it later today? Uh, I'm sure he'll talk about it uh, at some point today during uh, the team meeting. Uh, he hasn't addressed it with the team yet, but uh, I'm pretty sure he will. What did you, did you talk to Brandon after the game the other night? Uh, I just shook his hand, told him he did a great job, and uh, just stay focused and stay humble, and uh, you know just keep doing the things he's been doing. What does he need to get better at? What What do you see that he needs to do? Uh, you know, just continue to grow in this offense and understand, uh, you know, what's going on. Uh, obviously, this week we're going to have a new game plan. So uh, just familiarize yourself with the game plan and know all the checks and everything he needs to know in order to uh, run this offense Saturday. How do you think he'll respond? It's a pretty hostile environment at Auburn. You've been there before, so you know. What are you going to tell him about that? Uh, you know, everywhere we go, we try to turn it into make it our home, you know. So, uh you know, hopefully we can get in there and do that and, uh, you know, just make him feel comfortable by putting some points up on the board early and uh, just try not to let it get too rowdy in there. You know, at times, you know, uh, when it gets too loud, uh, the ball's rolling their way, it could be easy for a young guy to get nervous and, you know, uh, kind of lose track of things. But hopefully we can keep him on page and keep him going. Does he bring our confidence and energy to the huddle? But looking like, man, this guy's just a freshman, but he's stepping in, he's like confident and he's like energetic. He's like... Is that a little bit different from what you've seen from a quarterback as a freshman? Uh, I wouldn't, wouldn't say he brings a lot of energy because he's really a quiet guy, you know, uh, but he has this quiet confidence about him when he steps in, and, uh, you know, I think that's important as a quarterback. The offense seems to speed up when he's in there, right? Do you feel like there's a little more up-tempo? Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, he, the, pack, the package when he gets in is always a little bit different from what Anthony runs, so, uh, when he gets in, it's always a little bit more of tempo because we're trying to catch him moving around and not in position. Why can Brandon do that? He, he seems to be. Uh, to be honest, both of them can do that. It's just the package that, uh, that that Coach Cam gave him to work with. The handoffs any different? Uh, no, nah, they're pretty much the same. They have the same footwork, uh, no matter you know who, which quarterback is in the game. Did you, as a senior, talk to Anthony about the way he played and? You know, trying to cheer him up, trying to make him feel a little better. Uh, you know, I just told him to keep his head up. You know, everyone makes mistakes and ha has a bad game, but you know, as a quarterback, when you make mistakes, it's easy for everybody to notice that. Uh, you know, a running back, if you miss a cut or you miss a block, you know, people that people don't really notice that because they're not watching that part of the game. But uh, I just told him to keep his head up and stay focused and just keep coming to work because at any moment, you know. Uh, Brandon can go down and then he's the guy again. So uh, we're, we're going to need him to stay focused and keep and stay ready.